and welcome to Weekends with Wendy. I'm sitting down because I want to show you what I got from my trip. <laughs> I was like, from where? From my trip, from Bangkok and from Seoul. Um, I don't know where I'm going to put this. In the following weekend vlog, maybe? I don't know, but uh, it's just, I put them all in my shopping bag here. So I'll just grab whatever and show you. First thing I have is, or are, I, oh, if you can hear the fan, I have the fan on, it's freaking hot in here. Um, I got eyebrow pencils from Etude House. These are their drawing eyebrow, and they're in the color uh, 04 dark gray. I got four of these. These were like 4,001. Did I get it in Korea? Yeah, I did. They're 4,000 won each. So it's around $4 Canadian. Then I got something from Daiso. I went, I went, I shopped at Daiso. Daiso was my place. I love Daiso so much. Uh, I got this little sponge, makeup sponge holder that you suction cup to like your mirror. I thought this would be a good place for it to like dry a bit. Uh, and this was 1,000 won, which is around a dollar. Uh, oh, also from A2 House, I got the Pang Pang Hair Shadow uh, in the color 03 Natural Black, which is supposed to like, I think you're supposed to put it on so it looks like you have more hair. Or is it supposed to tint? No. I think it's supposed to cover up like your scalp. I'm not sure. But I remember seeing someone talk about this before and then when I was going around the shop, I saw this and I was like, let's pick it up. I think this was around $16 Canadian, so hopefully it's good. Uh, ooh, I also got this Dior Lip Glow. Um, where was this from? The Latte Department Store at the Dior counter, because they have the color 031 Strawberry, which I cannot find in Canada. So, I mean, then I Googled it, and I did see it on like the Canadian Dior site, so I wonder if you can only get it from the Dior store or the website only, unsure. But I think this was the color they made for Jisoo in black pink for her birthday. 031 strawberry. I got this from a random shop uh, when I was shopping at Myeongdong. It is called Petite Girl Royal Jelly Sensational Lip Balm. At first I was going to grab my sister's this too. I think if this was around 11 bucks. But luckily I grabbed one first to try it. And I, I don't know if I like it but... I mean, the packaging got me. Look at this. Look at this. It's all like rhinestones. And how do you, oh, you push it out. There you go. Do you push it out? Or are you supposed to, yeah, I guess you just push it out. That's weird. But yeah, it's like this little red color stitch. Ugh. But I didn't get anything in there. Um, then I got a Hello Kitty scrunchie from the Daiso. This was 2001. Uh, what is this? Oh, this is the Sika Hyalon Riedel Shot 300. It says VT Riedel Shot 300, which is like a, what is it? Facial boosting first ampule. It feels like needles when you put it on. Uh, it's really weird. I just got these little tiny like sachets of them from the Daiso. Oh, this is not even mine. Almost opened it. I have another one here. That's for a friend. This one's mine. Um, did I open it? Uh oh, which one did I open? This one. This one looks like it's been opened. There are, I think, six little packs in here. Yeah, and I gave two away to my sisters to try. But it's just to try because they're it's kind of freaky. And I honestly didn't have enough like luggage weight and stuff to bring more stuff back. So sad face. But yeah, I got this to try. Also saw this um, cleansing tissue from the day. So uh, I don't remember why I bought it, but here I am and I have it. <laughs> Sika Hyalon Sika Calming Cleansing Tissue. It says moisturizing and soothing. So that's good. I probably bring. Oh, yeah. I want to bring this to Vegas. Um, what else? Grab all my stuff. Oh, I got some stickers from getting the 
what is this character called again? Kuromi? Yeah. The, uh, what is that card called again? The KT card? T money card? <laughs> I'm terrible. This is your bad memory. Then I also went to the Laneige Bespoke Neo, which you've seen already, um, cause this video is coming after and I got my custom cushion and you could write a name and stuff. So I just wrote Wendy. I don't know what to write. I'm in the color 28 N1 and I don't think I've opened this since I've gotten it. I haven't used it yet. I've been saving everything to film this little haul. But ta -da! Look at it. I will open that later. Also from Laneige that day, after you do the bespoke experience, they give you like 20% off. So I wasn't planning on buying anything from there, but then with the 20% off, and then I like cross-referenced one of the prices with like Sephora here, and it's already cheaper there. So I got this Water Bank Blue Hyaluronic Serum, which I believe we do carry here. I think we carry both items in Canada. There are some things that I haven't seen before, but it's because, see, this is what they do to you. They recommend some products for you based on your skin and then they give you 20% off so then you buy the product right right <laughs> and I also got the Laneige Radiance C is it just Radiance or is it Radiance C uh, double active brightening essence so that's what that looks like um, well, I almost dropped something then I got this little stick from the day so and it's to like apply foundation for when you're using a sponge this is like a thousand won um, I feel like, did I, did I like check if it was stainless steel? I hope it is. Uh, at Laneige, they used it on me, like one of the spatulas and I, I just never used it before and that seemed fun. So you like put on your foundation, like, you know, how you do dots and stuff. And then this one smears it on like peanut butter and then you use your sponge. So it's easier to blend. And then I got these items to put in a Ziploc bag. It came in a giant packaging from Costco. It's the Kahi Wrinkle Bound Skin Fit Blending Essence with Jeju Origin Oil. And I got the Wrinkle Bounce Multi Balm and it has two of those. And then this Aqua Balm, I think that one has SPF 50. Yeah, this was in a whole set. I wanna say it was around like, is it around $60 Canadian? Maybe. I just really wanted these sticks because you see it in some of the K-dramas where at least, which one did I see it in? Uh, that one, the attorney one. I forgot the name, but it was on Netflix and everyone was like, oh, so refreshed. <laughs> Product placement works, people. Um, and then I got my Gentle Monster sunglasses. I'm pretty sure I've shown you somewhere. You've seen them for sure. Oh, let me show you the packaging. It's great. I grabbed the sunnies from my bag. So these are the sunnies I got. They're the Gentle Monster Bold um, Eve in black. I love them. I think they look good on me. But there were other ones that looked, I think, better on me. But I really wanted the shape. And I wanted ones that didn't have, like, the brand on the side. And this just has, like, little stars. Are they stars? Anyway, it came in this crazy pink box I'm in love I think it's gorge but the case is even crazier I'm gonna see the mess behind me but it's a mirrored case oh maybe you won't see the mess it is a I don't know if this is plastic it might be plastic it might be metal I'm not sure I don't know but it's this giant case and then when you open it it's just like soft on the inside this was all like the packaging wrapping the glasses i kept it all but yeah who's gonna bring this case out like it's clanky i could use this as a clutch <laughs> um so i just put it in like a little soft glasses bag i had from something else and lastly i think this is like the last thing i got from my trip from thailand i honestly did not buy much from thailand i didn't even buy much from korea uh, I was really worried about luggage space. You're only allowed one luggage now in economy, so that was sad. I got these inhalers. This is the Pastel brand pocket inhaler, translucent, and it came with like 
Where are my other ones? Oh, right here. I was like, it came with more. It came with six. I took one of them already. So I have those. I didn't know which ones I would like. And I honestly didn't want to like, well, they didn't have any samples where I got at the airport. Um, and the places that had the samples were more like those little pots. I think they're called Yadoms. Am I saying it correctly? I don't know. Um, but I thought that was too complicated. So I went for like the Vicks inhaler style ones. And then I also got a huge box to like hand out to my friends from the airport. And it came with like a bunch of these in a pack. But honestly, it's more expensive to buy it from the airport. So you should just buy it locally. Um, that is it. That is everything I got on my trip, I think. And like souvenirs for other people which you probably would have seen in one of the vlogs. Thanks for joining me here. And then we're gonna continue our weekend vlog. This was just the intro. <laughs> um, I don't think I showed you what I got for Brandon. I think he got the best thing. So first off, I found him some really cute pajamas from this place called, I don't know if it's Spa or Spao, but it's spelled S-P-A-O. And it honestly feels like it's like the Korean Uniqlo, like it's their own thing, right? Because Uniqlo's Japanese, from what I can recall. Um, so I got him these really cute pajamas because they had some collabs going on. And they are Pokemon pajamas. And they're Snorlax because he's the sleepy one, right? <laughs> I thought they were so perfect. Um, they had like short ones, but the short ones didn't have like the full print. But luckily, I found a store that still carried, like, this probably is last season's because they're long sleeve. So it has a full print on the top and the bottom. And then at another store, I found something to go with it. I got a little Snorlax eye mask. Look how cute that is. Yeah, I think you got the best thing. I didn't even get myself something that cute. Oh, I did get my hat from that Spow store with the little bear. I think you've seen it already. I'm trying to think what else I got. I really didn't shop much. It was tiring. I was planning. I had to look at the map all the time. <laughs> it's hard to lead a trip, but it was fun. <laughs> we are at Markville Mall now. We haven't been here in forever and everything is under construction here. We ordered some cha time and they're just making it now. Um, yeah, we're shopping around we're trying to figure out what to have for dinner. The mall's about to close. <laughs> What's for dinner, Brandon? What's for dinner? What's for dinner? Pardon? <laughs> oh my god, I look so bored. <laughs> right now I feel like with this lightning. <laughs> we are at Deer Garden for dinner. Uh, we ordered, now we're just waiting for our food. Popcorn chicken! Like, I haven't been here in a while, but we always order the same thing. So here I got Malay laksa with the Korean potato noodles with fish filet and choy sake. He didn't get his yet. drinks, but he got his noodle. Look how small it is compared to mine. Mine's like a freaking mountain. I asked for the chili oil. Don't skip out on it. It's so good here. And then we got our drinks. He got hot milk tea and I got hot lemon tea. Hello, it is Saturday morning, I think, and we're already on the road. We're heading out, and it's going to be a while. There's quite a bit of traffic on the road, but I'm going to try this. Is it called a, what would you call it, a, pro, a protein bar? I think it's called a sample of this RX bar in blueberry flavor. So let's give it a this try. This is what it looks like. I finally opened it. It looks like a squashed compressed banana bread <laughs> but it's blueberry it smells like a blueberry donut let's try eat the back mask stay to the left to express I don't like it we are at the mall now and we got lunch finally it's like 2 p.m um after my protein bar it's my first meal basically we got thai express at a coupon so i got a free drink and a free spring roll we got fish pad thai this is always my order and i got medium spice hopefully it's not too spicy we're gonna get some cocoa this used to be like a pink berry right how old we are pink berry world 
when frozen yogurt was all the rage. <laughs> at dinner now, and we're having Subway. We were gonna take out, and then we're like, hey, we can dine in. Let's dine in. He said he was so hungry, he wanted a whole bucket of popcorn chicken at KFC. <laughs> I got the rotisserie chicken build your own and we got some cookies and I also got KFC has let me show you it's hot onion rings now isn't that cray cray we're gonna try it out hello it is Sunday and it's Mother's Day happy Mother's Day to everyone out there who's celebrating we are at Costco for lunch at like 12 30 on a Sunday which is shopping and looking for carry-ons and now we're at Gong Ta getting bubble tea which I haven't gotten so long here and we also got a cop spread for my mama hope she likes I think it was raspberry and custard tea time I think it's called I'm not sure but we're thirsty you gotta get some bubble tea. we are at glass kitchen celebrating Mother's Day and it's a wild ride already <laughs> Um, I hope the food's good and worth it. <laughs> I'm freaking dead. Some of the people at the table. Are healthier than potatoes. We'll stop there. The Jakarta lamb skewers that comes with a peanut sauce, a brown stuff, and the red stuff is a red cabbage. What sauce? I don't know. I'm literally just eating fried chicken. This is the entree. It is fried chicken and caviar, and it just, just fried chicken and caviar. Nothing else. <laughs> this is wild. <laughs> and he got the GK burger with yuca fries, which we learned yuca is just cassava. Itadakimasu!